Peace, infinite waters diving deep once again. Beautiful deep divers. We are out here in the heart of nature, baby. A hundred degrees, super hot. But are you getting high right now? Are you smoking a blunt right now? Cause you're so cool. Just laying in the shade, sipping lemonade. 10 secrets marijuana users never tell you. Let's just, woo, breathing in that good ass prana, baby. No, no, no. We're just getting high right now, like you are doing right now, okay? I got a great question that came in. Ralph, please talk about marijuana, how it can help us become our greatest version. Does it have any benefits? Okay, so deep divers, we are about to dive really deep. If you've got a question, add me on Instagram at Infinite Waters. And as you know, deep divers, I'm always getting high, breathing in that good ass prana, baby. RalphSmart.com slash close. Check out the good ass prana merch. So deep divers, sometimes I wake up and I'm really high. We ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello there? And that's because I'm breathing in that good ass prana, baby. So marijuana, cannabis, that's right. A lot of people smoke cannabis. You're probably smoking a joint right now while you're watching this video, aren't you? Okay? I don't smoke marijuana, but I have done in the past. I have had a lot of weed cookies and ended up with a massive hospital bill. I was in Venice one day and the first time I ever took weed cookies, a friend's like, oh, here are some cookies. And I'm like eating them and I'm like, what am I doing right now? Where am I, right? Like, that's another story. The first secret, <laughs> marijuana users never say, never tell you because they're too busy getting high, is that marijuana has been cultivated. It has been used for over 6,000 years, documented, okay? In the Indus Valley, all over India, all over Africa, in Egypt, okay? Ancient Kemet. In fact, the goddess Seshat, the goddess of wisdom, has a cannabis leaf over her head for protection, for wisdom, okay? So they were getting high. The ancients were getting high. And that's probably why the ancient Egyptians were so advanced because they were able to see beyond the 3D physical reality. Because this is the Maya, like they spoke of in the Indus Valley. It's all an illusion. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. So it has been cultivated for thousands of years, okay? And in ancient Egypt, one of the oldest medical documents, texts in the entire world, the Ebers Papyrus, okay? Talks about the benefits of hemp and cannabis for treating and alleviating pain for inflammation, okay? But seven day vegan challenge, shout out to everybody who's doing the seven day vegan challenge. Hemp, and this is why I will tell you, I don't smoke marijuana. If you smoke marijuana, that's great. I will use marijuana though in the future because of its benefits, okay? But I'm always naturally high. But when it comes to the seven day vegan challenge, hemp, which is marijuana sibling, Yes, I'm taking hemp every single day, hemp powder, because hemp is a complete source of protein. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. Okay, hemp is a complete source of protein. And therefore, if you are eating a lot of hemp, good on you. If you are drinking a beautiful hemp cacao smoothie, you're making me jealous right now. Actually, I'm happy for you, okay? What's the second secret marijuana users never tell you, okay? 
Now, marijuana, the active ingredient is the cannabinoids, the THC, okay? And therefore, the properties of the cannabis plant makes it psychoactive. In other words, when I took those weed cookies, I just thought they were regular cookies. Like, I'm like, yeah, I'll take them. I ain't even had breakfast yet. And they don't really kick in till about an hour, right? And I'm like, oh, I'm in Whole Foods, like really like, where am I like tripping? But in that state, firsthand experience, I will tell you this deep divers. I was able to see reality dissolving. I was able to see the fakeness of our society because a lot of people who are smoking marijuana, eating <laughs> cannabis, okay, will tell you that we came here to be free. And when you are really consuming a lot of cannabis, you just want to be free, okay? And therefore, you are having altered states of consciousness. In ancient Egypt, they had the lotus flower, okay? And this also gives you altered states of consciousness, just like marijuana. And when I took it, I was having trips. I was like, oh my gosh, nothing is what it seems. You see, you've been sold a lie by society. You're still trapped in the matrix and scratching your head. It's time to be free. That's what marijuana does to you. It gives you a different perspective. It gives you the ability to see reality in a whole new way, okay? What is the third secret marijuana users never tell you? Now, I'm chilling on the beach, Santa Monica with good friends. And we were just talking and I asked him, why do you smoke marijuana? Because he's a marijuana advocate and he's like, you see, Ralph, experienced marijuana users will tell you this, okay? That we don't smoke marijuana to get high. We smoke marijuana to be connected to the oneness of all things. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. I had to do a slow motion right on the beach feet in the sand and everything, okay? I'm like, whoa. And I could really see because this amazing being was super woke, super awake, had so much light inside of him. And that's why he was smoking the marijuana because it's all about connecting to the oneness of everything, okay? And that's what marijuana does. You see, in our society, we have the ego, which is all about separation, mine and yours. Even my own experience taking those weed cookies, I was able to lose the ego. And that's what marijuana does, okay? What's the fourth secret marijuana users never tell you? Now, disclaimer, I took the weed cookies and I actually got a hospital bill because I was like driving and I had to pull over. I didn't know they were weed cookies. If I had known, I would have stayed at home, right? <laughs> like my good friends were saying, Ralph, you should, when you take weed cookies, like two weed cookies, I, they were so much, right? You don't go out. I was driving, so I had to pull over. I actually went to the hospital and got a really expensive bill, thousands of dollars. Thank goodness for insurance, okay? <laughs> it's not for everyone. I don't need to smoke marijuana. Why? Because I'm getting high off that good-ass prana. However, however, wait for it, marijuana is a super powerful herb to help us become our greatest version because it's got so many benefits, so many healing properties, so many healing properties. But I don't need to smoke marijuana because I'm already naturally high. Check this out. Can I get a hello there? Marijuana users won't tell you that it's not for everybody, okay? Sometimes it works for people, sometimes it doesn't. Don't smoke marijuana because you think it's cool, because you wanna be in Venice Beach smoking marijuana, doing ollie and a kickflip saying, yeah, I'm so cool right now. Do it because either it's helping you become your greatest version, it's healing you, but it's not for everyone. 
And if you don't smoke marijuana, you still can be really cool. I promise. What's the fifth secret marijuana users never tell you? Nobody, nobody, nobody has ever overdosed of marijuana. Yippee! How cool is that, right? There are millions of tobacco-related deaths every single year, alcohol-related deaths every single year, but zero for cannabis, zero for marijuana. Like when I took those weed cookies, I actually thought I was overdosing deep divers. I'm like, I can't leave. I haven't kissed a cat down the road goodbye. And I'm like, wait a minute, I'm still here. I'm still here, right? By the way, we are immortal, okay? I can never die. I just multiply. So I started to realize this, that nobody has ever overdosed from marijuana. And that is amazing. Nobody has ever died from taking marijuana, okay? Because for you to overdose on marijuana, you would have to take 40,000 times the normal dose of THC. Mm. Which is impossible, slow motion this side in one sitting. Mm. Okay, so marijuana is a very, very safe herb. In fact, it's safer than tobacco, okay? That's probably why it's illegal in certain places still, okay? California legalized it because they're all getting high down there. They're all getting high in California, right? <laughs> We're all getting high right now. <laughs> What's the sixth secret marijuana users never tell you? Deep divers, hemp, which is marijuana sibling, has thousands of uses, okay? Hemp, seven day vegan challenge, is a complete source of protein. Hemp powder, okay? So if you are on the plant-based lifestyle, eat more hemp, okay? But one hemp plant can save 12 trees. Mm. I love you, hemp. Slow motion this side. Mm. Hemp can be converted into biodiesel paper products, hemp concrete. So hemp is so important for our survival, okay? Like so, 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 so important for our survival, okay? <laughs> now you asked with marijuana, what are some of the uses in marijuana? I will tell you this, if we look at it like this from a broader perspective, marijuana, and this is really the seven day vegan challenge, can help you lose weight, can help you get into shape, okay? That's number seven. Because with marijuana, with a THC, you have to realize that it lowers cholesterol, but also with the THC, it helps regulate blood sugar levels. Therefore, it can be a treatment for type two diabetes. Okay, so 33% of cannabis users are somewhere right now, raising their hands up to the sky. <laughs> Obesity levels are 33% lower in cannabis users, okay? So that's why a lot of my friends who smoke weed, they're always like looking in shape. I'm like, how? They're like, Ralph, I'm just smoking every single day, okay? I get it. What's the eighth? <laughs> Secret marijuana smokers never tell you. Deep divers. Now. Marijuana, cannabis, the active ingredients, there are many, but THC, the cannabinoids, okay, also 
CBD. Now, Harvard studies will tell you and Stanford studies will show you and Cambridge studies will show you, top university studies will show you that cannabis, marijuana, helps to heal cancer cells, okay? Because if you look at it like this, a lot of times it inhibits tumor growth, okay? So therefore, cannabis is super important when it comes to getting rid of cancer. You don't need chemotherapy, take cannabis, okay? It inhibits, it inhibits tumor growth, okay? So take more cannabis all the time, okay? Studies, university studies have proven this, okay? So it does wonders. A lot of people are stuck on pharmaceuticals and you have to really realize that THC can help cancer cells, okay? So take more of it, okay? What is the ninth secret marijuana smokers won't tell you? Deep divers, you see, what's helped me along my journey? And let me share with you this, is that you have to realize this, plain and simple. Every single day, people want to escape. They wake up and they check their phone. Oh, I'm here. Okay, they wake up and they get distracted by music videos, okay? And I'm here to tell you that you never use marijuana to escape, okay? People who are using marijuana can use it for medical uses, okay? Marijuana has been known to get rid of seizures, okay? Epilepsy, all of this stuff, okay? So it is wonderful for helping people with seizures, okay? Check out some of the videos on YouTube from from people having seizures and then after they take cannabis, automatically it stops, they stop shaking, okay? So it helps healthy nerve functioning, okay? So if you've been having seizures, share with me your stories, right? If you've taken cannabis and tell me what it's done for you, but there are so many thousands of uh, videos and documents saying how it helps people with seizures. So that's why you gotta really respect marijuana. And what's the 10th secret marijuana users never tell you? 9% of marijuana users become dependent. 15% of alcohol users become dependent. And 32% of tobacco users become dependent. So marijuana is the lowest. People who smoke marijuana are not likely to get addicted, okay? And that's why when I took the weed cookies, I wasn't addicted. I don't get addicted to things anyway, but it wasn't addicting, okay? So that's the beautiful benefit of marijuana. So deep divers, once again, there you have it. Whoa, 10 secrets marijuana users won't tell you. And once you realize that deep divers, well, you just say, feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? Yeah. Beautiful deep divers, we're out here in the heart of nature, baby, just Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Getting high, literally. I want one, Ralph. Check out the good ass prana shirts, ralphsmart.com slash clothes. If you've got a question, add me on Instagram at Infinite Waters. Have a beautiful day, deep divers. Infinite Waters, diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy, peace. You. Should we get high together, deep divers? Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. I get high naturally. <laughs>